Illustrator is a fantastic program, but it's not compatible totally with LaserWeb, but neither was CorelDRAW. LaserWeb's the program that goes with mBlazer 2. But I just want to show you what I mean, and then we'll try and do it in paint and uh, see if it works. So A4, millimeters, create. So I'm going to draw a box there, just an outline, file, save as. I'm going to save that as an SVG. Okay, and we're going to fill it as well. File, save as box two SVG, save. Okay. And delete that one and go into paint, draw a box, fill it in, box fill, solid fill, file, save as. I'm going to make it a JPEG. box paint I'm going to change that to go to USB drive file open and I'll just bring this one from um, and here And select it. This is a bit of mucking around here with object. We have to go image trace, make and expand because we're going to delete all this white section. Ungroup. Then I'm going to select just the white. So I clicked on the white section. Select same fill color. Edit cut. And now I've just got the blank straight square box. Now I'm going to go File, Save As, an SVG, and Save. Now we'll go into this program here, which is LaserWeb. A little bit slow to open. Add a document. We need to go into the USB drive. So we've got the box SVG. That was the one that's just the outline open. Now it's opened all right, but it says it's got some issues. Box two, which was the full outline one. It's got some issues as well. But if we add the document here, one more box paint, sorry, box paint SVG open, it had no issues. It's come through perfectly. Those two belong to those. So when you're doing this, if you've got basic shapes or in fact text, you're better to do it with paint first, then open it into um, Adobe Illustrator convert it into an SVG there so it'll work and with the SVG files you can cut as opposed to laser raster. Thanks for watching another video by Digital Dovetail. Like and subscribe.